What's up YouTube, FTW here bringing you another Cinema 4D tutorial. In this tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to use Throwsy and where to get it for free download. So let's get started with this and I'll show you how we can do some things with this. Let's add a floor. and Then uh, we'll go to our floor, right click, dynamics tag and add a dynamics body. That basically makes our floor solid. Then we're going to add a Go to our objects and add a cube. Go to our Y axis down here. Type in 100. Click apply. And that'll raise it to the floor level. And then what we're going to want to do here is go to where, right up the top where it says plugins. Click on that. Throwsy. Type in where it says pieces. We'll type in let's say 35. And go down here and click break now. And it's breaking it up into little pieces as you can see. And close that out. Now if we uh, hit play on our timeline, you notice it'll just fall into pieces. That's just one way of breaking it up. Now you can also go down here on where it says trigger. Change immediately to on collision. And then we can add a go to our objects and add a sphere. Let's just raise that up in the sky. Go over here to our sphere, right click, dynamics tag, dynamics body. Now if we play this, when the ball comes down a little shatter, you can also, you get your in and out collars right here for your uh, cube itself. And you pick the first one, this will be the end collar. Let's make it a dark um, blue collar. I'll be fine, this is just an example. Make the outside collar. See, let's make it a dark gray. As you can see, don't look too bad. We'll add this to our sphere as well. Render this out. Pretty simple effect to do. You can see it shatters into pieces, but you can also select each individual piece. Go to Throwsy again. Let's say if you wanted to break those individual pieces so they're smaller pieces, you just break it again. And then hit play again. Now you notice there's some smaller pieces. And you can keep individually selecting these smaller pieces and breaking them over until you get the desired look that you're wanting. Let's type in 20. Hit play again pretty easy to work with you get some smaller pieces in there basically uh, if you go to I'll put the link in the description for this it's made by a guy named Nitro Man you can donate to him right over here pretty cool it's worth doing it's a free download tells you all the information how to install it you know for what Windows and Mac this is if you have R11.5 or R12 R13 you just click things to download pretty simple to download it's not too hard to work with but makes everything look pretty easy to work with I mean pretty much does everything for itself and you just play around with the settings and the values down here to get it to how you like and come up with something pretty neat if this helped out any please check out my channel subscribe leave any comments below Message me with any uh, tutorials you want to see. And link will be in the description for Throwsy. And thanks for watching.